NHS, save our NHS. Save our NHS, save our NHS. Save our NHS, save our NHS. Save our NHS, save our NHS. I feel that the government's imposition of a contract that's both unsafe for patients and unfair for doctors uh, is something that we should fight against and we've been left with no alternative except uh, to, to take industrial action. It's regrettable uh, and it's, nothing, it's something that none of us wanted to do at all but we've just felt that we've been backed into a corner and have no other choice. This is the first ever strike that's taken place without any provision of emergency cover and basically that means that the service that would normally provide it at the weekends by junior doctors, so minimal staffing on the wards, uh, it has been removed. Um, today. The work instead will be covered by consultants and other healthcare professionals such as uh, nurse practitioners, pharmacists and, and other people who, who can help. Um, so we do feel confident that patient safety won't be impacted at all um, but uh, as I say we, we feel that this is the only option we have left. And the message all along has been that we just want to, to negotiate the contract. We've had people, representatives from the BMA, sitting outside the Department of Health down in London uh, waiting to try and speak to Jeremy Hunt and, uh, and unfortunately he's, he's decided that that's not the course he wanted to take and of course that's meant that we're now stuck in this position where this is the only option left. Um, but ultimately the, 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 the point still remains, if, if he's willing to talk then that's exactly what we want. Firstly that it, it represents a, a change in the contract which would, would mean that we're, we're, as junior doctors, are more likely to be forced to work longer hours. Uh, some people who are in part-time training will be disadvantaged um, and, uh, and this, this, these obviously we feel would impact negatively on the NHS generally and uh, overall would have an impact on patient safety. That, that's the main concern we have throughout these strikes is to make sure, make sure that care is, is maintained at the same quality standard.